Hey YouTube family, welcome back. Welcome back today. I am back with Zule Hi. because I'm lazy, okay? And I'm the <laughs> I know y'all been waiting for nail videos, but you look, I didn't be in the house and I don't probably put on my nail stuff to do nails, so I do hook y'all up when we come here. So make sure you guys go check out her nail supply, okay, at Zule Nails. And um today I'm gonna do my left hand. Uh, Zule's gonna foul it, <laughs> but I'm gonna apply the acrylic so you guys can see. And she's gonna do my right hand. And today we are getting ready for me to go film Wilding Out. Our theme is um, apocalypse, and um, I'm going to. It's all dark, so I'm gonna do black nails with some glitter, and we're gonna stone it out like we did last time. Oh, and also I re just took my nails off, so if you go to her page, you can see that. How long they lasted and stuff like that that the stone stayed on great so you can go check out all her products all right let's get started all right guys so this is my nails and all right uh they got black on it because i was dyeing my hair are you selling these drills no 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 it's a sample so pinky out top around Finger. today we're these are just press-ons i literally just glued them on so there's still like some residue glue on the top of my nail Stilettos today, and we have some Zule nail glue right here. All right. Is this a brush or just a squeezy? It's a squeezy one. Okay. Just gonna squeeze. Yeah, no mask. Yeah, it, it it came out fast. Let me try to find the other one. I say yeah, 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 yeah. All right, make sure the sides go from one side to the other side. Remember, our pinkies are about a zero. I mean, I'm sorry, not a zero. And from, from an eight to a ten, the three middle fingers are normally a five three four depending get off of me Big too big. I have little fingers. Ta da! Okay. And now I'm just going to drill a little bit. Now that the nails are on, get some Bond-Aid. And 
she has two different nail primer. So we're gonna use it all. Make sure it doesn't get on your skin. And we're gonna apply it. All of this product is available at Zule's Nail Shop. All right, guys, so today we have Zule's Black and Zule's uh, Glitter, and we are going to just... Thank you. Some of them I want to do whole, some of them do free style, so let's see. And the glue. dark huh hmm. pigmented i like it i like it it's nice and chunky chunky now when you're using color acrylic and you're doing like designs and stuff and you're not doing one solid color you're just using it as paint you guys am i recording oh yeah sure mm -hmm. it looks perfect I'm just gonna move it a little bit right there. And we're gonna encapsulate it with clear. So this layer does not need to be thick. Don't use your whole jar of color acrylic on this because we're gonna encapsulate it with clear to make it thicker for you. Thicker, better for you, thicker, thicker. I was like, damn, Mimi already used the nail sun? <laughs> Wait, when you went upstairs? Yeah, I'm like, damn, I would have still been fighting him now. <laughs> Girl. Oh, get it out. I'm going to be done before you know it. Oh, I'm over here looking for the glue and you're already done gluing them. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <gasps> yeah, I just ordered these. I'm like, hmm, I feel like people are used to that little squeezing one instead of that. Uh huh. One. But since it worked good, it dried fast. Yeah, that, that, the that's squeezing why I one like dried it. way faster. Like that dried really fast. But um, we were moving around um, our area over there, and it disappeared. I was like, where'd it go? Yeah, but that, that dried really good, though. I just had to squeeze it slower because it's a little bit more watery mm -hmm. than the other one, but it dried much faster for, for nail tip. Like gentle. You are gentle. Those are going to be some toxic girl nails. <laughs> That's what we're going for, um, we're going for like a gothic, you know, okay. gothic look here. I bought a bunch of, um, like leather, black leather. Ooh. So, you know, suck my cockiness, lick my persuasion. You come around, you come around. I want you to be mine. Oh, anything by my desire. When are you gonna go to to film? Yeah. Um, Wednesday I I leave. Oh, next week already. Mm-hmm. So I was like, gotta get my nails in. Okay. I know, and then I was like, ooh, it's good. I didn't go to work today. Oh, uh, pass like, me, pass me the clear. Oh, right here. I went on Wednesday instead of today. Mm -hmm. On here. Got a mat. Black is so staining. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I ordered on the table. <laughs> you just be in here with a glass. Here. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm just making sure you're recording good. Yeah. I know, they were like, uh, maybe you weren't in the frame the whole time. I'm like, they don't understand. It's hard to record and work at the same time. So now we got the clear and we are going to take it from the top to the bottom to encapsulate. So this is why I told you, you don't have to use the color acrylic so thick. You can use it like nail polish. You're using it like just paint. And we're gonna cover it with clear. Hold the finger, let the finger hold down so the acrylic can maneuver and drip down. It's like riding a bike. I can do my nails. I haven't done nails in so long. But you know what I noticed? Like when I go and I go uh, on a maternity leave, that's like the longest I don't do nails. Mm -hmm. And I come back and I'm brand new. Maybe even better because I miss it. Yeah. yeah. I've been debating on starting to do nails again. And I gotta know. Maybe you should do part time. And then I think it. just one day. <laughs> one day? One day a week. That's good. That's that's, shit. that's still like a lot of clients for you. You're like 20 clients. Right? <laughs> that's enough for a week. Did you put on your eyelashes or did you have those on already? Huh? I did. Oh, my fucking eyelashes stuck to my key. Oh, I was like, what the fuck? Did you put those lashes on with this glue? <laughs> <laughs> I was getting out of the car. I was like, um, because I put my key up on the cupboard and, um, when yeah, I, I saw them I was, right now. I was like, did you just put them on? Well, I went to the wrong house first. <laughs> I went to the other house, and then I was like, this don't look right, because it said, congratulations on graduating 2021. Oh, and I was like, like ding dong? No, I just, I was like, this can't be right. So I just drove down a little bit. Like, Patrick's not graduating? The right, I was like, he's not no 2021. Like, he's like my son age. Yeah, he's going to be in 8th grade, right? Your son? No, 7th. Mm -hmm. Oh, Patrick is going to 8th grade. Javon got a late birthday. Oh. Yeah, it's November. The end of November. So, he yeah, I'll start later. That sucks. My nephew, yeah. too. He was supposed to start this year, but he's a sip. No, November baby, too. Mm-hmm. I'm proud of him though. He brought his grades up and passed. That's good. I told Patrick that if he gives me an N for something, he's gonna be my slave all summer. He's gonna be working, working. <laughs> he'll be my little assistant. Mm -hmm. Mine just get his game taken away. Well, you know, we took it away until he brought his game up during the weekdays. We er, took away the game and the phone, and he still gets distracted. <laughs> so hopefully that's motivation. I had to get him a tutor. You know, because I think, um, you know, we were in Atlanta, so their school system is a little bit slower than out here. And then it's harder, too, because they're doing it online and things like that. So I feel like that's why Patrick B. Yeah, it was the online that set a lot of things back. Distracted AF. Voila. Voila, that... we're done. And um, look, you guys. So my eyelash is connected to my <laughs> key ring. So she was like, uh, what the heck is that? Okay. It's an eyelash. I need you to file. All right. Zule is doing my other hand. So, you know, every time I come, we do Zule boot camp. Mm -hmm. Let's go, Zule. Okay. One, two, three, four. Five, 
six. Am I supposed to move on already? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Next. One, two, three, four, five, six. How seven. many seconds do we'll I do have? Seven each. Okay. So seven each. So. Okay, let me go first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Next. One. See, this is boot camp <laughs> training for Zule. I'm fucking sweating. <laughs> <laughs> she does an amazing job, y'all, but Rosila is way beyond this. I just need to hurry the fuck yeah. up. Yeah. You're taking her precious time. Mm -hmm. I mean, look, my butt, my butt shots can't handle that long. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to start deflating over here. I'm going to have to bring down my work table. That one, you could stand up. <laughs> <laughs> no. Sit or stand. <laughs> my butt's good. It's, my butt been around for a long time. All right. Okay. Tip. No, let me turn this off. Control. And nail tip. Let's go. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm gonna start dropping shit. <laughs> I'm gonna start dropping shit. Yeah, when I get nervous, I drop shit. <laughs> I fuck things up. Okay, guys. Remember, these are about a nine through ten. Dab, pick up, and slap. Oh, I didn't even make it home. <laughs> mm -hmm. We in the frame? Yeah, we in there. Good job. So fast, I'm fast as fuck, boy. I'm fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> I need everything extra speedy. And right now with the summer, I think it, everything dries faster, so mm -hmm. it's in our favor. I want you to be my slave, anything that I deserve. You know what? I haven't used gel polish in so long, like, I think I suck at painting. I suck at painting. I suck at painting. I mean, I'm getting better. Before, I think some gels were too thick or some of them were a little too, too transparent. And yeah, the and formula. The pigment, so you like keep having to paint. Yeah, it. and I think that's why I hated it. But now the formulas have gotten so much better. Makes me want to try it. Mm -hmm. But then just thinking about brushing the nail, I'm like, mm. I don't know. I, it makes it lose its shape. Like putting gel polish on, I just feel like it makes you feel lose your shape, and then I would I'd be wanting to file. I'd be filing afterwards. Look at them with the shape like nice and sharp and fresh. But then it's it sometimes it takes the nail, you know, I take the nail polish off on the side, so I don't like that. You know, next time I think we should try the gel extensions on you. You'd probably like that. Okay. It's fast. <laughs> <laughs> it's faster. Where the fuck is my gel? Your what? It's because you're missing a little oh, edge yeah. on your nail, mm -hmm. so I'm gonna file the the little tip. I just placed an order for some that are kind of like this length, mm -hmm. so I'm gonna do it on myself. The gel extensions. Mm -hmm. When I want to do faster, I do gel extensions. Is that with the? It's kind of like the press on method. Pressed on and then you pull with it out gel. on the bottom. The poly gel. No, so pretty much you just put um gel on your natural nail, mm -hmm. a layer of it, and then for example, if this is the full tip, mm -hmm. instead of having it half, it's oh, full. It's all the way in. You put more gel there, and then you press it and oh, flush okay. it. Right. So it's pretty fast. Yeah. But you gotta paint it with gel. That sounds like a cheat. You don't gotta build acrylic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you for don't. Who don't? Uh, who? You know what? Back in the day, like we had like the poly gel kind of feel like i remember our boss introducing it to us and everybody who was doing manicure thought it was so easy so then they started you know trying to do that on clients to make mm -hmm. more money but um yeah no it didn't it was lifting it was lifting for a lot of people but maybe they have a better formula because this was good 10 years ago yeah i used to think that it was for lazy bitches you know because i was like the fuck i'm over here working my ass 
Oh, I'm trying to do these nails, but during COVID, I started doing it on myself. I'm like, hell no, this ain't for no lazy bitches. This is for bitches that are trying to do this fast. Right. Yeah. And don't got time like that. And it still lasts too. Okay. I want to I wanna see it. So next time we can do that. I'm fast as fuck, boy. I'm fast as fuck. That's a sound on uh, TikTok. It's so funny. I don't know why every time I see when they use that sound. Oh my God, you're like, I'm fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> Your eyeliner look good today. Mm, thank you. I was trying to dry for like five minutes right there too. I be taking my sweet time on everything. My mother-in-law be like super fast at her cooking and I'm right there just in one egg. <laughs> and I'm like, how are you finished? And she's like, it's because you take too long. You walk too much. <laughs> I walk back and forth for shit. She said like you walk too much. Yeah, like I pace a lot. Uh, like I want to multitask, like make my coffee, get the bread or whatever. Yeah, when I be hearing people took a whole day to cook Thanksgiving dinner and I'm just like, like, they'd be like, oh, yeah, I've been cooking for two days. How? What are you doing for two days? Like, I can cook all things in a day. I can give me, like, four hours by myself, four or five hours. And, you know, except for the turkey, like, you know, I'll prep that the night before and put it in the oven. So I don't count that. But, like, all the side dishes and stuff. Like, I'll cook everything by myself in, like, four or five hours. I can't cook like that. Yeah. <laughs> I only know how to make rice. <laughs> and breakfast. <laughs> Whatever works. Mm -hmm. Does your husband know how to cook? Um, he does more than I do, but I'm learning little by little on YouTube. Good. Because before I didn't have time to practice, and mm -hmm. now ever since COVID and all of that, since we be stuck at home, I was forced mm -hmm. to make time because we couldn't go out. But I kind of enjoy it. Okay. okay, now Zule do for me. Okay, honey. You don't have to match it. You can put wherever you want. Damn, I think I'm done already. Just one nail. Yeah, I see. Zule's <laughs> using my big 20 brush. Oh, you, it's big enough to pull from the top to bottom. It's like, bam, I'm done. Uh -huh. Like that line that I made the other day with my liner brush. I'm like, damn, bitch, I don't even have to try. Is there already a nail? Yeah, good job. See, make you move faster. You have to finish the whole nail already. Okay, Zulay. So Zulay is trying my brush today. You know, this is my, it's like my screwdriver. But you know, when you're used to something, you know, it's hard to switch, switch over and try. But I can make anything work. Remember I was using that little brush at one time? Oh my God. All her nails fucking broke off. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, this brush is huge. My brush is, I mean, 16? it's kind of big, but not this big. Is it a 14 or 16? This one is a 16. 16. What is this one? A 20? 20. Yeah, one. but I feel like every manufacturer does the sizes different too. Yeah. That's what I've noticed because those glitter handles, they come bigger than the pink ones mm -hmm. that I carry. So lame. You are moving like a jackrabbit, girl. <laughs> you fast, fast as fuck, boy. Oh. I gotta show you that sign, that that sound. That I'm fast as fuck, boy. I'm fast as fuck. And the the temperature also helps. So yeah. I'm about to steal your brush now. You feel it? Like it, it's it's a. But I can't find it in every store. Like. And I, like, it's hard to find online and it's so expensive online. Yeah. It used to go for like only $35, $40. It's because like $60, Kalinsky hair is really expensive right now. Like my manufacturers, they've been telling me that the prices have rose a lot. Because the little animal that they use for it, uh -huh. people are afraid to go hunt for it or it's just hard to find. Wow. And I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? Because I tried to place another order to start my next batch mm -hmm. and it like doubled if not tripled i'm like what the fuck i ain't about to buy no more yeah. brushes because the flip is not even worth it yeah look at him he, oh my god he on a yeah stroller with the one wheelie he cool as fuck <laughs> you see him yeah he had a one wheel scooter and one hand pushing the stroller 
That was super dope. Yeah, so I was like, I ain't about to make no profit here. Or like, people are gonna come and like, what the hell, Zelay? Who do you think you are trying to Price raise the prices? Yeah. yeah, but they don't know that the price. The price home cocaine is raising. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anything that I desire, I want you to be my sex toy. You got so much stuff. You got so much new stuff too. I do. I need to store? stop. Um, I was actually thinking about it, and I called some places around here because mm -hmm. I don't want to go too far. Um, and this stupid guy, this real realtor, whatever. Mm -hmm. He was fucking rude to me. I was like, fuck you. I don't want to fucking rent this place or whatever. Because I called. Well, actually, I texted two places online. Because mm -hmm. they asked for your information so they could give you a call. So I didn't know who, what location he was calling for or whatever. And I was like, what location is it? And he's like, well, if you don't know where it's at, then I can't help you. And I'm like, wow, mm -hmm. fucking rude ass. But I'm like, I called two places. How am I supposed to know which is which? So I was like, okay, it's a sign from God. No. Well, no rush. Yeah. Until the world open all the way up again, you know? So I was like, I kind of do, but then I don't want to because then and it's you gotta like... you got to go open up every day. That, and then open. what if somebody steals my shit when I'm sleeping or something, you know? Mm hmm Or like, it catches on fire. Insurance, girl. You gotta have insurance. Yeah, but then I have to shop all over again. Yeah, you're right. Girl, look at you. You on your fourth finger. You fast hey. as shit. I'm like, I'm making a mess though. Like, it don't matter. Because you're going <laughs> to clean it up when you foul anyways. It's on your skin. <laughs> I don't know. Not that bad. But black is staining between black, red, and white. Those are the mo the three most staining colors, the hardest colors mm -hmm. to polish or to use. And normally, I notice that um black tends to dry slower. But for some reason, this one oh, I'm gonna put the glitter. Oh. Um, for some reason, this the black from this, my colors yeah, the and the color white dries thick. fast. You can mix some clear in it. And I'm like, slow if you down. mix clear in it, it'll it, it spreads it out like. You can make four, five jars from that. I'm like, slow down acrylic. Please. And then it'll, it'll slow down. It wouldn't be as like, um. Pigmented? Yeah. I've always mixed clear into like those kind of colors. It last longer too. Like you get more out of the product. Mm hmm. Cause you know, you've seen people use like eyeshadow. Yeah. Mm hmm. I don't want to stone it out. I don't know if wants to. I'm excited for my gothic look. They're nice. I'm not a big fan of black nails on myself because mm -hmm. I feel like they're a little too sad for me. But if they bling down, then maybe. Mm -hmm. It's going to look so cute. Yeah. Excuse me. I paint my toes black too. I'm going to go for toes right now. Somewhere over the rainbow, Zule, she's fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> yeah, girl, next thing you know, you're gonna do them long sets in three hours. Mm hmm. Yep, I'm gonna have to. What size is this again? Size 20. I'm gonna tell my manufacturer, like, hey, you carry this size with the little diamond on the back. Mm hmm. This is your little diamond, right? The smaller sizes don't have a diamond. Or I think they charge a little bit extra for the diamond. I don't know. Yeah, like my favorite are the pink. Wait. Oh, I guess I don't have any pink candles. But they come in a thing oh, like this. Cute. Because they have a cap. Sure. Mm. She said she liked this one with the cap. The only thing with a cap because you see I, I, um, I spread my brush mm. really flat and wide. Like I, I pinched it, it's, it got pinched right here, and then yeah. I flatten it as I go, as I clean it, so it won't fit back in the top. 
that's true mm -hmm. but for like 3d flowers and stuff this is good or maybe you'll come with a bigger cap yeah if they have a cap that's bigger some then it look like a lollipop it mm -hmm. can fit back in <laughs> but i yeah i be i be smushing it when i clean it i just let it hang somewhere oh you hang your brush i heard some people say that they hang their brush you know we have the light Mm -hmm. yeah, stick it up there. Okay. Oh, girl, think, you is fast. I think I'm done with the black. Yeah, Zule. Now we're going to use this clear. Yes. Girl, you is black. Who is this Speedy Gonzalez? <laughs> my God, is, is that Zule? Zule? She's energized. Yes. I be putting pressure on her, y'all. I know. I be putting pressure on her. I'm over here like sweaty, is, low key. This is our. Um, but you know what? The brush does help because that shit is huge. Yeah. For long nails. And you always do long nails. It's not like you do short nails. Mm hmm. Look at that. And it holds a lot of liquid. So you can, like, you know, maneuver it. I'm like, okay. Girl, you as fast as fuck. I'm hungry, too. You didn't have um, breakfast? No, I just woke up and I was like, oh, get up. Because yesterday, I accidentally, when I woke up, it was like 2.30. I was like, fuck, can't be that late. Because, you know, it takes me an hour to get to you. I had to get dressed. So I opened my eyes. I was like, oh, shit, perfect timing. I know I was laughing because I was on the computer and you're like, I'm up. <laughs> I'm up. I'm up. Like, I didn't forget. I'm up. <laughs> I'm like, okay. I used to tell my clients that because I used to hate when clients would book me like my first appointment mm -hmm. and i'm all about sleeping in like i have trouble falling asleep but yeah. once i'm asleep i don't want to get up yeah so i had a client like all my first client i'd be like text me when you're up to let me know you're really coming <laughs> because if i get out of this fucking bed and i get to the shop and you're not there I'll i'm be gonna be mad because yes. i could have slept in longer i love sleeping in but falling asleep is so hard that's true. I'd be telling my clients, you guys better not fucking leave me hanging because I'm driving fucking 80 miles. Yeah, you were driving. And if you bad. leave my ass hanging, I'll be pissed. I don't got time. I don't got time to get here early, getting ready for my day, being productive, and you're not here. I could have went and got a freaking donut. I don't even eat donuts like that. <laughs> well, luckily, they, they haven't left me hanging because I'd be mad, mad. I whenever like I had clients that would be like late as fuck or like they wouldn't text me and it was already ten minutes. I would. You'll leave. be surprised people leave deposit. Don't really give a fuck about their deposit. But yeah. You, when I did the nail class, I was charging two fifty deposit. Right. People didn't show up. It's like why? I was like, uh, you must have like had extra money on you were like your tax return. You were just say fuck it because people were not showing up, and that's a big deposit to not show up for. I remember my first. My first time in California was my class out here. And I stayed at Airbnb. And the Airbnb I stayed at was in a shed. So in the backyard, they had a shed. And they built the shed into a room. Mm. And it was actually so fucking cute. Like, they had a bed. had everything you could think of in there. They had the bathroom. They had a little stove. They had a refrigerator. They had a desk. They had everything in that shed. It was really cute. Kind of like those um people like me, me. home type of thing. Girl, that. no, it was a shed where you put your lawnmower and shit. <laughs> <laughs> it was many, maybe one of those tiny houses. Yeah, it was a tiny. No, their house was in the front, and then they Airbnb their shed. Oh. But it was really nice. They built it into a tiny house, so it's really nice. But I remember my first time out here. I was like, I ain't moving out here. It costs too much, and everything looked like a desert to me. You know, because like in the East Coast, we have a lot of trees, like acorn trees and mm -hmm. all different types of trees. But here it was like, you know, you have palm trees, but then you had like cactuses. And it was a lot, it's a lot of dry area, like that. Yeah. It was like a desert. But here, look at me now. Moved to Cali for some D. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> I go wherever the D go, whatever. <laughs> but how do you like it so far? So far? good it's peaceful and then i think i'm older so you know it's a lot different like i grew up in dmv so that's like home for me like knowing my way around and that was my culture like the dmv this hood and then atlanta was 
black Hollywood, you know, and I do miss Atlanta. I do miss certain food, people. I had a lot of people in my life. You know, a lot of things went sour, a lot of partying. But I think Cali for me is a little bit more mature. You know, like it's expensive, but it's kind of worth for what you get, right? I don't really feel like when you have good credit and you can get a low interest rate, it's not that it's not that expensive. Oh yeah, I think we got lucky too because of the COVID situation. Mm -hmm. Cause I don't know what your interest, the interest rate, rate was, was but cheaper. mine was like two point something. I was like, Woo, okay, yeah. sold. So yeah, Which, mine's like a three three percent. I was like, what? That's like free almost. Mm -hmm. Well, at least that's what I was told. Yeah, my interest rate out in Atlanta was like 12. Like, I was paying 25 for the house, but every month I was paying, only $300 was going to my principal because I didn't, have, my credit wasn't good, you know? Like, so it's actually cheaper. My mortgage now is cheaper than in Atlanta. Mm-hmm. Because of the interest rate. I had never bought a house before until this one. But my car interest is higher. What was that? Good job, Zule. Mm -hmm. I'm like, we're becoming senoras, Mimi. Yeah, we're getting older. So it's more peaceful, I think, you know. I feel like I'm growing up. Like I, When I look back at like all my old pictures, I can see like the stages of life that I've been through. Actually, when I was pregnant with my son at 18, I acted like an old lady. An old lady? Why? I don't know. Because I was pregnant. I was becoming a mother and I was acting like an old lady. Your body is changing. Yeah. I'm still, you know. I'm not as I'm not as ghetto as I used to be. Like, I'd be looking back at my old videos. Like, I was... My makeup was dusty. Like, my eye... <laughs> Neither one of my eyebrows is even. My eyelashes was always big as fuck. I didn't wear a foundation. And I always wore this hot pink ghetto ass lipstick. And I used to talk real good. Because, like, you know, I was still young. And, like, growing up in DMV and used a lot of their slang. I was like, kill Mo and young. You wally Mo. Like, that's how I used to talk. But then as I move, you know, like, my accent, like, adapts to wherever I'm living. And now I feel like Callie is making me more preppy. It's like dragging out the words, you know? <laughs> and it's like, oh my God. It's more bubbly out here. It's, it's chill. That's funny. You're going to have a California accent soon. Like you say that I have. You have, yeah, you have a, you have a, you have a California, like, but a Hispanic accent. When people say, you're, you know, people like your voice. They were like, they came here for, remember the comments? I was like, mm -hmm. I came here for Zule's calming voice, not Mimi's loud ass. <laughs> you're like, I'm going to have a calm voice soon. Because I used to be crazy before, like. Yay, Zule. I, I used to be a little wild too, a wild child, but I kind of come down a lot. Fast as fuck, boy. Look at that, y'all. Zule mm -hmm. was moving today. Mm, they're a little lumpy, but we <laughs> I'm like my life. Alright, so real time. Oh Bio time. I said time. a lot of bad words. They're gonna I curse a lot too. They're gonna kick me out of the club. No, they're not. It's just you get less like you get less advertisement. There's certain companies that doesn't want to advertise under first thing. What if I cuss in Spanish? Ay, callate la puta pendejo. <laughs> I wish the camera was looking at your face. <laughs> I was in character. <laughs> she was a whole señora. I was a whole señora. Ay, cállate la mente. Cállate la boca, pendeja. Tu madre. La tuya. Tu padre. Yo abuelita. <laughs> That's funny. I want you to be my best friend. Anything that I desire. <clears throat> Lay your head. Yeah, I was like, look, Zule does a bomb job filing the shape. She can go here and file it. It's hard for me to file on my own. Cause like, I so, struggle too. To, yeah, to hold my finger. 
Yeah, I got some acrylic down in this one. Um, Lenny! Lenny, what you doing, boy? What them doing? Where him go? Where him go for a ride? Hmm? Lenny? Yeah, I took him to the park right now. You to the park? Did you get to smell any booty hole, Lenny? Did you get to smell anybody's booty? He's like, hell yeah. Like, there's people celebrating birthdays right there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I was like, can we do that? Yeah. But I don't know if we can bring a taquero in there. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, we can. Until somebody complain. <laughs> Until a carrot come. Yeah. You guys are not supposed to be no, doing but this. It's, it's big enough for like, there's like three big areas. We can take up one spot and, and we'll take up the whole pool. Lenny. Lenny, what him doing? I'm tired. You got to come out. Huh? Look how fast you lay with. <laughs> like Lightning McQueen. What'd you get? What'd you get the time? We're gonna do. Um, she was telling me that your yep. team was midi. No, I thought. Uh, I was like, I don't know what she the told me. The like pre-apocalypse. So it's oh. like the end of the world. What did oh you say it was? Medieval. Medieval. medieval? <laughs> like, what is that? And I'm like. <laughs> No, I was like, she told me she has a theme, but I don't know what it is. I forgot. Medieval. Medieval yeah. was like, uh, medieval was like. I thought that's what you told me. No, med medieval would be like New Orleans, right? Like yellow and green and, right? I Gold, told her, green, I told her, purple. Think, think Shrek, the first movie. Yeah, medieval. Uh, yep. I was like, we're going to put her on horse, like a peanut. Like <laughs> <laughs> no, it's pre-apocalypse, so it's like dark. Like the end of the world. And why did they, guys, why did they make you guys do things? Uh, the contest or no, 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 no. Um, like the background, you know, the like last year we did um, new school and old school. So our color was like the old school was wearing black and the, old, the new school was like white. So with pop colors of neon, like pink and blue and green and stuff like that. With, you know, baby colors. So we're like baby pink, baby blue. And then this year it's gonna be black. So I'm gonna wear like a lot of leather. Like, You're not gonna it. rip it. I don't, I, don't. I don't know. I got stretchy leather, so they wear that pleather. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and what's what's the whole thing like? Oh, um, it's it's a comedy. Mm. It's comedy, so it's like rapping and comedy. Mm. So we have different games that we play, like different mm. rap games. I think, I think, I think it's some mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, not enough to know exactly. Yeah, what it's on literally it. just joking games. Yeah. Jokes in game and rapping. And to be funny, that's it. And you just you just coming out in one episode? Or? No, uh, uh, I do um, this year because of COVID. So I'm gonna be, you know, it depends. Like last year, I had like like six six episode. Um, but sometimes you can be on more and then don't even have a moment. Like because we film for a good hour, but the show come on TV for like 25 minutes. So mm. sometimes you think something is gonna hit and be funny, and then you go on TV and wants to come on and you're not even on it. So I, I did pretty good last year. Like, just the episodes that I was on, I did have a, a moment. So it's all about that. Yeah, I told my brother, it was like, oh, um, I used to lie and made me hang out in her room and did each other's nails, you know? And my brother, my brother, know you? Uh-huh. And he goes, oh, she came in with Bob and that. Did you know Nick Cannon? Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, I know Nick Cannon. But, like, not like, hey, what's up? Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of, uh, I, I like, I watch it. I mean, I used to always watch it before, before like when I first went viral. I always wanted to be on it, right? But then I ended up being on Love and Hip Hop, which really didn't fit me. Mm. And then, you know, somehow I got on it. I was excited. <laughs> it's funny because little clips of Love and Hip Hop of yours come out in my YouTube feed, and I clicked on one the other day. I was fucking <laughs> cracking up when I think you were wearing like a blue purple wig or something like that. Uh huh. Um, that you wanted to like fuck up some girl. I was uh, like, fuck me. Well, it's a blue wig when I was like, you grandma ass bitch. <laughs> I don't know. It was like little clips uh, put together. Put together, yeah. yeah. The best moments. Yeah, it's pretty funny. So, so, so do you get nervous? Because I what? see, I oh, see well, like, uh, Yeah, I yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's harder than you think. You know what I'm saying? You think you just go up there and say anything, but no, like you have to practice. You got to practice. You got to learn the games. And you got to like, and then you're on the stage and there's all these cameras and it's so bright, all these lights and, you know, you get nervous. Like, like me over here. Yeah, I'm learning more. <laughs> Dropping the go. fucking file. It doesn't lie that when she gets nervous, she, she likes to drop a lot of jokes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she starts dropping stuff. She's doing good, though. She takes my little, I said, come on, let's go. <laughs> Boot camp. Yeah, I can imagine nervous, like... Uh, especially the one where you like face to face battle. Yeah. Like, uh huh. 
I think for me, morally, is I talk really fast. And so I have to learn how to slow down on my talking. Because a lot of times people don't understand what I'm saying because I talk so fast. Yeah. You know, and I talk, and I, I yell a lot. So. You Mexican. Yeah. <laughs> Look, tell him what you were saying earlier. What? When you were talking what? in Spanish. Ay, callate la boca, pendeja. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't she make like a señora face? I'm good at acting, acting mm -hmm. and stuff. Like You're that. natural. Who, me? <laughs> yeah, so learning how to talk was my biggest thing. Like, because I have a mic connected to me. Sometimes I'm holding the mic and then, you know, I'm just yelling. A lot of times I'm like yelling. So... Once to go on the mic, people are like, my first season, people are like, what the hell did she say? I don't, like, I don't know. <laughs> They're like, what did you say? I was like, I don't even know. I'm watching it back. I have no idea what I said. So, you know, calming down. Calming down and actually saying all of my words. Because a lot of time, I don't pronounce all my words correctly. So, they don't understand what I'm saying. I was so fat on my hip hop. I've been trying to lose weight all week. And I gained two pounds. <laughs> <My soul. laughs> Muscle. It's so hard. Food is so good. Uh, and I used to talk to my brother. My brother had a bowl to me. I think, how many is it? 50 pounds? 45? Mm -hmm. And he's at 30. And he said, I, I asked him, what do you do? Because I don't see you do naked. So then he just stopped eating fast food. Yeah. Just stopped eating fast food and drinking soda. And like he watches his calories. So yeah. Right? Well, I don't. I don't eat fast food and I don't drink soda. So it's like, well, what the fuck else you want from me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you want from me? I have to literally run. Yeah. Run and just stop eating at all. Because I don't I don't eat bad, but like I like chicken skin. I like steak fat. Like I like the fat part. <laughs> You're so like, I like the bad stuff. <laughs> yeah. Put your little arm it's on. not like uh, candy or like junk food and stuff. I don't eat that. But the steak fat and stuff like that, oh it's so good. I can just sit there and eat steak fat all day. <laughs> I show that to the live when I'm cooking a steak and I go like, oh, that's the best part right there. Yeah, today. that corner. And that makes a face at me like, oh, it's so good. <laughs> you eat the fat? I yeah, it's yeah. the, the best part. Do you know carnitas? Carnitas? Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Pork? Yeah. Pork? yeah. Oh. Man, you have crispy uh, pork? Yeah. Oh, so uh -huh. good. So I, I made a crispy pork belly inside of the, the air fryer. Uh -huh. So good. I like the skin. I eat the gristle, like chicken gristle, the bones and stuff like that. Like, my boyfriend eats chicken wings and he needs all the good parts. Like, like the corners. Me. You do that? Oh, hell you no. told me last time, remember? Oh, yeah, yeah, that yeah. I was yeah, eating yeah. the uh -huh. chicken. I was like, oh, you didn't even eat the gristle. I need that. <laughs> I'll go back and eat it. So I look like a dog eating the bones. <laughs> I'm such a dog. I'm like, <laughs> and I don't have class when I eat, you know? Like, people be like, oh. <laughs> Close your mouth. You make so much noise, but I make, but people watch me because I make mm -hmm. everything look good. But I don't have no class. ASMR, homie. You know, back in the day they had that show called Charm, Charm School. Mm -mm. Um, so basically it was like you know Flavor Flav. You know you heard of Flavor Flav. Mm -hmm. So yeah, the dating show, and then like um, Brett Michaels had the uh, is that his name had the dating show, and so all the girls from those shows would go to Monique. She had a show called Charm, so they would learn how to have class. Mm -hmm. You know. And I need one of those classes because <laughs> I just don't have any table manners. So I went to a wedding one time and I'm like, oh, I'm so nervous, you know. <laughs> I, was like, how I, feel. I was like, I don't want to spill anything because every restaurant I go to, like, I spill all over my shirt. Me I drip too. and I use my fingers. And I had on this wedding dress and the sleeve came down here. So I had like T-Rex arm. I couldn't reach anything. <laughs> And I was trying so hard not to spill anything. I still ended up spilling a whole pitcher of water. Oh I'm like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm like, okay, just pour it for me. Like, I need help. That's they funny. They should definitely do one of those again because I have none. Well, I'm going to finish the, the tea stand tonight because I got a lot of things to do. Okay. Um, maybe good luck. Yeah, thank you. Good luck because I'm pretty sure it's time. Yeah, thank you. Yes, girl. This arm is gonna get worked out. All right, time to do file around my cuticle after we finish shaping. We are on a road today, girlfriend. Just a little bit. A little bit of drilling in my life.
I ordered a dust collector, so next time I'll be like sucking it out like Oh, this. the sucking one? Yeah, because I had ordered the other one that in front of you. Oh, the that one that shit was one. whack. It didn't do no, it didn't suck shit. Like whatever fell, fell right there. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And it just collected that. It's not like it collected, like actually sucked it in or anything. I was like, I might as well just put a tray right there. And just let it fall right there. And just collect it. Yeah. For the price of the accessories. Yeah, I ordered one. Supposedly it's new and it has like a little opening. Mm -hmm. And you put it here and it's... So we'll see how that goes. That's exciting. Hopefully it's not heavy. Cause I have to put it on the table. I seen a big ugly vacuum one like <laughs> I forgot it was on somebody's page a while ago. Oh, is it the one that I have at the salon? Does it look like I don't know, it's huge. <laughs> it's like whoosh. But it's not everything up. It was pretty dope, but I have one. It's called the sunflower. Yeah. Yeah, at like the it? salon. I don't know if I used it on you last time. But it's kind of big and has a yeah. light, and I move it around, like it rolls around. Girl, I could be so much. I could be dusty by the end of the day, and I always wear black to work, and my pants be like white by the time I'm done. I like that one because it feels like a fan. So like, if I be hot, I just like put it right there, mm -hmm. suck some dust, and blows air, all in one. It means to always be mad. Your station is so dirty. Well, because I'm getting money, okay? And the dirtier your station is, I mean, the more money you're making. I don't have time. I don't have time to clean, okay? I My sister-in-law been killing some nails. I was like, looking on the page, but like, okay. You may be cute. Mm. Because when we first, like, bought the shop, when she first came to America, like, the shops didn't let her do acrylic, you know? Because she was she didn't know how to do acrylic. So she, they just made her do manicures and pedicures. Then when we bought the shop together, she really was still beginning, you know? And then when we started doing nails, you know, she was watching me make a lot of money. So she had to step her game up. Mm -hmm. And she's just been killing shit. She's way better than me now. That's good. And she's faster than me. When? Now her process, watching her process is ugly as shit. <laughs> like her process don't look clean. But when she's done, they look good and they last. Her nails are lasting. Is she the one that did your nails that were pink when you moved on here? Was it those? I sets? think they were I pink. So. I don't know. Yeah, because she was she was the one doing my nails over there. Yeah, it's a pink nude. Oh, that's okay. good. But she's heavy handed. Yeah, I think I watched that video and I was like, damn. She's like pulling my arm. Fast. Oh yeah, she's fast. She's fast. She's faster than me. I'm like, you don't got me beat. But she work, you know, six days a week every day, you know. She's getting more people practice. In and out. Mm -hmm. More practice. I feel so bad because when I left and I moved to Atlanta. Like, my career was just, you know, I bought that shop, I was a promotion, then I went viral, so the shop was busy, like, me between me and her, because we, cause, you know, it was hard to find workers, but, or anybody who moved as fast as us, you know, to get people in and out, and when I left, all my clients had to go to her, so she was overwhelmed, and she got Bell's Posley out of nowhere, and that's, like, when your muscle on one of your face dies, oh, man. and... She got better. She did acupuncture, so she did get better, but she was so sad. She was like, oh my God, one of my, the whole side of my face is fucked up. But I was like, it had to be from the stress, stress. and overworking, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. I know, I be feeling stressed from working and then I have to drive my ass home. And I'm like, girl, I can't even so see far, anything. Yeah. I used to be so tired. But luckily the shop when I was in Atlanta it was like eight minutes from my house. Mm -mm, not mine. I have to get me a frappe and drink it and give me some brain freezes so that I don't fall asleep and munch on some fries. That's why right now when they're like, you know, at first I was gonna go all the way out to LA to work, 
But I'm thinking about the drive. Like, when I go drive to the airport, I said, I don't want to do this shit. They're going to have to drive to me. They're going to have to come to Riverside somewhere because I'm not, I'm not going all the way out there. It's just way too much. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. People who drive to me, okay, you don't have to drive to me to get your nails done. Once. Once. But I, if I have to drive every fucking week for this shit, no. It's just too much. I know, that's what I was saying to my clients. I'm like, you know what? I think I'm gonna move soon. I don't know how soon, but this traveling is no joke. Because sometimes traffic could be up to like fucking hours. two, three hours. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, I was in that traffic for like four or five hours at the end of one day. Like, that's a whole other client right there. Mm -hmm. For me, for you, like work client. <laughs> We're not in there. Oh. Were we all the way over here the whole time? Yeah, I think so. Shit. Uh-oh. Okay, this is a really cute buffer that Zule has. I I love this. It looks like a nail file, but it's really sturdy. Mm-hmm. Yes, Zule. You did so good today. Moving fast. Look at her. Look at them arms go. See? <laughs> you even talk yeah. about that. Ooh. I'm all fat, but there's muscles in there. Yes, girl. All right, we're gonna have some fun with some stones again today because they lasted so good. guys time for the fun part and Zule has all these magical stones you could also find these stones at her page so we're gonna have some fun today you guys i want to make sure that i'm in the screen today because i know i wasn't so this is also her glue that she has and it's amazing We're just gonna freeze out some stuff on here. Don't exactly know what we're going to do, but we're going to have some fun. And bring the light closer so they can spark out. There is no right or wrong answer to how to do um, stones. Just have fun with it. Just make sure it look good though. Like, you know, that's not big dumbass gap in the middle of them. This is also her favorite part. Mm-hmm. The bling bling. It ain't about the money, money, money. Ooh, we don't want your money, money, money. I'm surprised my mom hasn't called me today. No. Does she call you every day? Sometimes, yeah. But she was here for a while, so she hasn't called me. So then she was, um... She had too much mm -hmm. <clears throat> it ain't about the money, money, money. Oh, yeah, come on, sit down. Sit down, let me tell you something, honey. Ooh, it's so pretty. The more bling bling, the better. Really, they, they hold up really good, so. Oh, I lost a diamond. I was like, I'm jealous. I need bling in my life. So I put two bling nails on myself. This is funny. Shit. Is it a shrimp tail? Yeah, I like doing the little. I like the shrimp tail. <laughs> That's what it reminds me of a little shrimp. Or a penis. Whore? <laughs> You're such a whore, Zule. <laughs> such a dirty little slut you are. Only uh, yeah. sometimes. Only sometimes. Oh, 
Ooh. I you wanna put a big chunk on this one. Like the 3D one? I have some new bling to look at. It's beautiful. I haven't put this on my store yet. But I'm ready for packing. I really love this this one. The cube? Yeah. Oh I know, I had to copy you. The fucking cube was awesome. They beautiful. You could be twins with a cube. It's all about balance. <gasps> no ma, fuck you, man. I'm like, I'll spray for you once you put it. <laughs> so okay, go ahead. Just close your mouth so you don't eat it. Now I'm scared to put the uh the glue on it. It's gonna dry so fast. <laughs> I don't want it to you know dry the blush. I mean you know just put extra so it starts mm -hmm. to dry but it doesn't dry dry. So much of you know what I'm looking for. It's like a child in a candy store. You're beautiful. You're beautiful, it's true. And I'm not bumpy with you. Why did you put <laughs> glitter if you're going to cover it? Because it makes a difference underneath. Mm hmm It sparkles more. Mm -hmm. You look like my decal. What if my? <laughs> yeah, I do match me. <laughs> You're beautiful. It's true. Low beach. You little sexy little bee. You look really so sparkling in the camera. So blend. Okay, this one. I used to do my nails like fully bling like that before, and then now I'm scared that it's gonna like get caught somewhere and I'm gonna get hair. But. I did fine too. You did what? You know how you said that you didn't like get hurt or anything like that? Yeah. Or I'm like, my finger was fine. I should add like three more now. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get caught on anything or nothing. Did pretty good. Did pretty good, man. Stay still, okay? 
Did the diamond that I glued on your skin stay there? Oh, no. Damn, that one didn't pop. It wasn't really on my skin, though, you know? Oh. It was like... I'm more than Half of it was, you know... But it was still pretty... It was touching you a little. Yeah. Wow. Okay, Miss Bling Bling. You want me to spray it for you? Um, wait a second. Let me squeeze something in here first to hold it. Okay, now we can spray. And I can continue with the process. Yeah, baby. The assistant. We're going to put you that song, the icy, icy, something, something. I don't know how it goes. Sweetie. You're like so fucking cute. Is it? It goes something like that. <laughs> That's all I know. That's why. <laughs> I see. I see. I'm telling him, I'm like, I'm gonna need some money. <laughs> Let me see what he says. He's over there building something. So it needs to go in here. <coughs> Meow, meow, you're my new meal. Wow. Wow, that looks beautiful. I like how the cube looks different under, I mean, over the black. Mm -hmm. Like it looks like a whole new color. <laughs> He's like, take my wallet. So Give me your wallet. So cute. That's because they have money. Like lucky charm. Yeah. One of my clients, she sent me a picture of these little. Do you know how to draw like this? I refuse. Well, she sent me this. I refuse to do it. She sent me this picture, and then I just started laughing. I sent her laughing emoji. She's like, "Can you do it?" And I'm like, "I wish." <laughs> like I could really draw a line, and she's like, "For real?" I'm like, "Yeah, they're cute, but I can't draw." I can do it, but it takes way too long. That I refuse to do it. I cannot draw. At all. I was like, girl, you have to Like, I would have else. to charge so much because, like, it it is so time consuming. It takes forever, forever, ever. It's like fifty dollars per nail, right? Per they have the part. printer, you know, the people with the printer. Oh yeah, they have sent me one, but it's like, it doesn't work good. It do, but it's just like the process of uploading it and stuff. It's like setting it up. You know, I'm not a computer tech like that. What kind of drove me nuts? You should have put your client to set it up while you were doing her nails. <laughs> By the time you get to that, then it's ready. Mm -hmm. No, I can't draw. I'm like, sorry, girl. I don't got those decals. <laughs> I have many. Many and Care Bears and Butterflies. Right. Find a sticker, I'll stick it on you. <coughs> Mm 
Wow. One more. So beautiful. One more and we are done for today. Why do we always end up making the thumb like a damn transformer? A transformer? Yeah. Like, look like a human, like a transformer. Like, we never do it to the other fingers, and then we get to the thumb when we do it. We did it last time, both of us. I don't know. We want to give it a little love. But then no love. I think we've run out of ideas by the time we get there. <laughs> <laughs> like, what else can I do? And you're like, mm, just like, whatever. Did you get a lot of compliments on your other nails? Oh, yeah, everywhere. Where, everywhere I go, don't go. <laughs> I got a lot of internet compliments. And if I do go to a grocery store or something, you know. Like this bitch frozen, but oh well. You're like, how do you function with those nails? They always ask, don't they? My son saw this nail that I was working on, making a little cluster. He's like, what are you trying to do on this nail? I'm like a cluster. Hello. These are cool. These are cool. Mm -hmm. A cluster nail. Oh, shit. This one is slide. I was like, uh, something look off. Then I gotta turn my thumb and shit. What time did you fall asleep? Around like 4 a.m. 4 a.m. Mm-hmm. 4 in the morning at the pancake house. They say that at 3 in the morning, the ghosts come out. Mm-hmm. That's the witching hour. It's true. Mm-hmm. That is the witching hour. <laughs> My client was telling me that once, when she was younger, that she heard somebody whisper her name in her ear. And she got scared. I was like, oh, hell no. <laughs> wow. Mm -hmm. That's how it be. I got to pass out. out. Okay, okay. Your turn. My turn. Okay, I'm going to need a little uh, elevation over here. I'm going to need a little bit of time for us to spill it. Okay, ma'am, I'll start with the, the ring finger. What about that bling bling bling? What about the ching ching ching? I'm like, come on, you bling bling. Don't embarrass me today. <laughs> that sounds like I gotta go pull out the, the other thing. Yeah, it was doing me dirty. Lenny, you like my nails, Lenny? His nails are long, too. Loving you is easy because you're beautiful. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> la 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 
Dressed in black, black, black with silver buttons, buttons, buttons. Oh, down the back, back, back. Her ass so fat, fat, fat. You want some cake? No speaking Spanish, my love. Get us pastel. My love. Kuriki <laughs> dakati. Uriki takata! Uriki taka! What? Cake? What kind of cake? Um, it says butter something, but mm. it's bomb. Patrick! He's up there. Oh, he hears me. I know he hears me. Ooh, beautiful, honey. Look so shiny, so sexy. Like the diamond in the sky. Look at you. Oh, yeah. Patrick, can you bring Mimi some cake? Please. Oh, that's just some. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what did I say to him last time when I say, um, what can I say? I said, bring whatever you think I would like to eat. And I forgot what he said. Oh, he, and he said something funny. We don't have humans or something like that. <laughs> No, oh, yeah, you yeah. told him, bring something that looks like me or something uh -huh. like that. And he's like, we don't have humans. I don't want to eat that. Mm -hmm. I thought you were eating ice. I'm like, where'd you get that from? <laughs> Put it in my pocket. I dry ice the whole time. <laughs> this girl on TikTok, I saw she eats starch. Like, she makes it in blocks. Or, she said it was starch, cornstarch. I'm like, what the hell? Have you seen a girl eat nail files? No. What the Little hell? Little Boredom shows like my weirdest addiction or something mm -hmm. like that. And she was eating nail files. Well, this girl was eating cornstarch and it sounded like that. <laughs> I was like, wow. Interesting. Pretty gross. Or the ladies eating cotton balls. Oh, yeah. I do remember that one. I, oh, all right. I get cotton balls. You know, it's soft. They're with nail file things. Like, that You're hurts. Crazy. New June, I come goodbye. Say to me. Thanks, Patrick. You're so sweet. What's going on? You like my nails, Patrick? Wow. Yeah. Mmm, We should pretend that we baked it. <laughs> I'm not a baker. I like to bake. I suck at baking. Not my specialty. Hey, glue, where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Wow. This one looks like an armor nail. I could have sworn you told me me anymore. <laughs> I was like, girl, what am I going to do under that category? <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> Google. I make so much noise when I eat and drink. I can't help it. 
I'm like, go, go, go. <laughs> like, I'm so loud. <laughs> I do everything so loud. My boyfriend was taking out the trash, and you know, like, he pulled his trash to find out quietly. And then here I come. Because <laughs> it's dragging shit. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just a loud person. Period. Mm -hmm. Meow. Meow. I think I make a good cat noise. <laughs> I don't know. Meow. Meow. like, you do sound like a cat. Meow. Mm -hmm. Patrick's gonna be like, well, we have a cat up in here. something like that the other day model oh, i feel like i keep doing the same shit <laughs> yeah it's like we run out of ideas like how many I'm different gonna, ways can i bling out of now i'm just gonna stick to with the one i like i'm like to the side but then there's like oh, the shrimp I to, yeah i was like i need to figure something else out but i don't feel like it because satisfaction mm -hmm. but this pinky is Oh my god, I just remembered last time I was doing your nails, my arm looked like fucking a leg. <laughs> That's how hairy it was. I was like, how embarrassing. <laughs> I shaved that shit right after I saw the video. I was like, Shut oh my god. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm gonna not look at the comments because people are gonna fucking... I don't think anybody said anything about it. Well, I thought... Once a lady did make fun of me because I had hairy arms. She's mm -hmm. like, you need to get rid of the hair. I was like, bitch, how about you give me money to laser that shit? <laughs> <laughs> but Wax I was it. like, rude. Wax that time. Yeah, so this time I was a little like, somebody gonna say something rude about my fucking arms? Because those shits look hairy AF. <laughs> I'm like, it's not my fault. I was born hairy. So I went straight to shave them. It's funny and shit. But then don't try to shave them every other day. Um, well, my arm hair doesn't grow that fast. Okay. It's been already like two weeks. Hey, so today with you, I just shaving my arm hair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Casual. Shave my arms. I'm lucky I don't have no hair. Shaving my arms. That's why I don't have no eyelashes either. Hairy people have eyelashes. Asians don't have hair. I don't have no fucking eyelashes. Do you, do you, do you? Do you love me, Mary Jane? No, I don't. You make me slow, Mary Jane. <laughs> I don't love you. I don't love you. You make me slow. You're frustrating. <laughs> you ever watch white chicks? <laughs> fuck your fart. Yeah. That's funny. Huh? Um, anybody ever tell you you look like Denzel Washington? Oh, what a beautiful chocolate man. <laughs> That's my shit. Oh my boy. Hello.
If you hadn't been sitting here for a couple hours, I would have thought you smoked a little blood or something. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, somebody gave me a fucking live yesterday. It was like, you're on drugs. I'm going to call CPS on you. Bitch, I ain't going on no goddamn drugs. This is just how I act. You know, I this am naturally like normal. this. Normal. Bro, so like the whole, like my trip with my boyfriend. And it was just like, he was getting so frustrated with me because he doesn't know, like, you know what I'm saying? How I act. It's our first time seeing how we act in front of other people. Like, you know, people, yeah. strangers, right? Mm -hmm. And I, the way I break the ice is making fun of people. I have jokes. <laughs> so he's just like, his face is all like, oh my fucking God. I can't believe she's saying this shit right now. And he's just like, chill, chill. We just met these people. I was like, babe, but this is, this is part of my personality. And he's like, you make me uncomfortable because I feel like I have to, just in case somebody try to fight you before the shit that you say because you be saying some wild shit. And I'm like, hey, look, I'm prepping for a while and out. I was like, don't worry. I was like, I've been like this for 30 years. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know who I can mess with and who I can't mess with. You know what I'm saying? I can read a person's, you know, aura or personality and I can automatically see who I can, you know, joke with, you know? Mm -hmm. And if I like you, I'm going to make fun of you. And if I don't make fun of you, I mean, I don't like you because you don't have the personality for me to make fun of. Yeah, you're like your Karen. Yeah, so everybody had a good time. And he was like... And then they know that it's a joke. Yeah. It's not for real. But his face the whole time was like... Did you just say that? And I was like... <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, babe. I stressed him out. That's funny. I do that too. Like, my brother-in-law, he always be like, damn, Danae, why are you, like, you, like, punched me. We're over here, like, just slapping each other, and you punched me. <laughs> That's what I write to him. Break my heart. Say you love me again. And then I have, like, random fucking songs in my head. Don't do hurt you cause. So it's like I move here and it's cold, you know, and then like there was never fly here and now I move here and there's fucking flies. It's something about me. He's my brother's convinced that I brought the cold here and I brought these fucking flies here. I was like, ain't no flies or mosquito here. Cause he was like, I was like, I got bit, something bit me. He was like, ain't no mosquito here. Like, ain't no mosquito in California. Yeah, next we thing do. you know. We have mosquitoes here. Yeah, next thing you know, I look at the news and they're like, oh mosquito mosquito outbreak. Like oh, the California. Horn, the no, that's the cicadas. That's on the East Coast. I haven't oh. seen them in ages. Ew, I see people eat them on TikTok. Ew. The, but there's so many of them. Like, their purpose in life is they, they come... Like, God is amazingly creative because who creates an animal that comes once every 17 years out of their dead shell, right? Have, they're blind. First off, they're blind. They can't see shit. For real? How the yeah. fuck do they get my arm all the time then? The cicada no, you know cicadas, not mosquitoes. Oh. Cicadas. <laughs> I thought they're only, they're only in the <laughs> I thought we were talking about They can smell your arm. I'm like, how the uh, fuck they get me all the time then? The bitch smells juicy. I'm a biter. <laughs> but no, so cicadas, they, they come every 17 years. Oh. So they come from the ground, from their body, the dead shell that they what shed the out fuck? from last year. And they're blind. And then they have sex. And then they die right after they have sex. So that's their purpose in life. Wake up from the dead every 17 years, have sex, then die. Wow. Interesting. Have, have a little pleasure and then bye, Felicia. Yeah. Like, they should make a cartoon movie about, you know, like, you know how they always like do these cartoons where the fish has a purpose or stuff like that. Or this rabbit feels like it should be a police officer or stuff like that. They should do one about cicadas and it's just like, I refuse to die after I have sex and only come out every 17 years. They should make a movie about a, a cicada who, who is destined to change their life and break the curse of dying after sex. But like, I'll be abstinent forever. But it's blind, bro. Like, the and they're so loud. Like, I remember when they were out when I was 14. When I was 17 years ago. And now they're back. I didn't know that. That was like a whole little lesson for me right now. <laughs> they don't come out over here this morning. Like swarming. But yeah, people on TikTok eating them. I'm like, y'all, 
I mean, I eat some nasty shit myself, but a cicada. <gasps> Whoa, look. You can see through this. Through my eyes. Mm -hmm. this, how many am I and how many do you see of me in there? Uh, I don't know. I can't really see. It doesn't do that. Just one. It's just see through. Wow. <laughs> Wow, look at you, honey. Beautiful finger. Beautiful nail. Beautiful design by Zule. I'm like, what the hell should I put here? A little baby. Baby girl, what your name? Let me talk to you. Let me buy you a drink. <laughs> oh, say, can you see? My darling, early <laughs> life. What's so proudly we hail? The sky looks so fake here, like it's just at a standstill, it's just blue. Like not a cloud. Not a nothing, like not a fucking tree, not a, <laughs> not a bird. I can't believe I was driving that one day to LA and like, just, I don't know, like five birds just like shit it on my windshield, like, I was like, what the fuck? Am I getting gang banged? Like, <laughs> so what's, going, what's going on? You're getting what's shot by on? a bird. Bro, it was like, it was so much shit just all hit my fucking windshield at once. I'm like, what the fuck? I was like in the middle of telling a story and it just shit. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? It was just so much shit out of nowhere. That's funny. They and had diarrhea. Even, and I didn't even see a bird. You know, it was just on the highway. It just hit my windshield. It was probably somebody's barf. <laughs> no, it was white little shit, like bird shit. It was so much. Have you ever seen somebody's car with a bunch of bird shit? Like, damn, bro, where you live at? Where that was my at? fucking car when I took it to wash the other day. I was like, fuck, the machine didn't even fucking wash no, it. No, it was like all over. Yeah, you never seen one? I've seen a minivan where it's all over. I was like, bro, where do you live? Under a tree. Yeah. Like, where do you park your shit at? You seen that one, um, <clears throat> that meme? That has a um, my little diamond thing. That has a pigeon, and it's like, hmm, who am I gonna shit on today? Like Mimi. <laughs> if I was a bird, every day I wake up and try to think who I'm gonna go shit on. Like who's day am I about to fuck up I'm today? Break my heart. My hands are so cold. Are you cold? I'm always cold. He hates it because I try to put my feet on him and my feet are cold. My hands are cold. Oh, on a hot day, that'd be nice. What happened? Mm -hmm. oh. All right, guys. These are the finished products of my beautiful nails. Thank you, Zule. Make sure you go, guys. Make sure you go, guys. Make sure you guys go check out all the other nail classes and videos if you want to learn. Keep on practicing. They're so fucking cute. Thank you, Zule. I'm so excited for my nails. Make sure you guys go check out her Instagram and her YouTube channel also. And I would go check out her products. You know, look, she done sped up, you guys. So proud of my girl. <laughs> Still slow, but I'm trying. No, that was like over half of the time. Don't you think so? Five minutes different. <laughs> no, not at all. <laughs> Thank you guys. I hope you love them as much as I love them. Wow. Bye. Bye.